What's going on everyone? Today we're going to be trying out Moria and we're just going to take a brief look at the deck here. This is a build that was ran by Gerard uh, in a flagship tournament. So let's take a look at the leader and then we'll get some gameplay going. Essentially he's like trash Dofi. Except he technically costs a card, but you can play it from your hand. Um, so you can play like, or, or well, you can play the card that you discard. Um, but it's Dawn X1 when attacking, pay two Dawn, so he swings six instead of seven. Um, but discard one card from your hand, pull the top two cards of your deck into the trash, and play one Thriller Bark Pirates character with a cost of four or less from the trash. And all the solid ones are four costs, as we'll see. Uh, but this is his playing two Kuzan, which feels fairly standard. You kind of pretty much play the Admiral ratio that you would play in Sakazuki. But of course, this being your Don minus for the removal cards. Suru minus 2k standard. We've got Blino, uh, Adam Sandler, the blocker. Uh, brand new, loads up the trash, gets you your Admirals. Also can get you... Um, Tashigi, another 2k. We got Sabo. I think it's one of the best cards. Uh, this card becomes even more important one because you can load up that trash for Moria, but you also can prevent your cards from being destroyed against Sakazuki uh, and just things like that. We got Luchi. We all know what Luchi does, but then we've got Absalom. You may return two cards from your trash to the bottom of your deck in any order. Then KO one character with a cost of two or less. Now, this card is really strong for a number of reasons. Uh, one, of course, being that KO, but we now also get... So you can combine this. There's some nasty combos, but you also... We get Moria, which this card is busted. Um, this card is honestly way too powerful. I really carries them. It's a four of pretty much in any black deck. But on play, choose up to one cost four or less and up to one cost two or less from your trash. Play one of them, then play the remaining rested. So some people play the dog. Uh, this list did not play the dog. But you, of course, can bring back Epsilon. On top of that, you can bring back Helmepo. And on play, you go minus three. So then he KOs a five. So you can KO a five while playing this and getting 14 Dawn worth of characters on your eight curve. So very powerful indeed. Uh, not to mention if you have Kuzan or perhaps you play like a Suru uh, to go there or even, you know, um, the Kuzan swing. But then we've got Dr. Hodgeback on play. Return two cards from the trash to the bottom of your deck and put one Thriller Bark card from your hand into your trash. So you play this, you play this, you essentially uh, go net zero on your play in terms of hand. So pretty strong there as well. Also can get back this 2K or even like any other card you might want to cast. Um, but on play, uh, you've got Victoria. Uh, if your leader has Thriller Bark trash, five cards from the top of your deck. So boom, you can uh, you want to get Epsilon in your graveyard. And so you just play this, boom, trash, very strong first turn. Then, of course, you got Prona as well, just absolutely nasty. Uh, if your opponent has five or more cards in their hand, choose one of the following. Your opponent discards one card from the hand or give up to one of your opponent's characters uh, minus three for the turn. Uh, so you, of course, can go boom and use it for the minus, but a lot of times you're going to use this for that hand discard. And then again, just another Moria target. You can go Perona, or you can go Mor Moria, bring back Perona, discard a card. And so you can essentially, like, tax their hand a lot. Then we've got Shigi. Again, we were just touching on Helmepo, but we've got four Ice Age. Now, this is really interesting considering... Uh, the only removal really is Absalom and Luchi. But if you, you can infinitely cycle this because you can swing here uh, and bring him back. So this and this, essentially five Dawn, uh, four Dawn if you use Moria to bring him back. And you can KO seven costs. And then, of course, only three. Only three. This card's pretty free, but only three. Uh, the minus twos. But essentially, you just really want to get Absalom in your trash because then you're going to use him for removal. But uh, let's go ahead and dive into a game. Uh, 
This is really good, and I'm going second. I'm gonna keep. I'll play this, then play this. Actually, maybe I just play the Zon. I might just play the Zon. What, what does she do? Oh, they just played it. They got Niji. Oh, do you want your time two or less? Oh, this card's really good. Play this, load it up. No hits. That's rough. Uh, I will pass. I do have this, though, which is really strong. Uh, five. I'm going to take. Draw one. Play out Niji. Why would they return it to my hand? Interesting. They have five cards. I just make them rip one. I can make him rip one, or I can play Kuzan. I think Kuzan's going to get me farther. Let's go five face. See if they counter. They did. Okay. So now I just, yeah, now it just makes sense for me to play that. But they're going to draw more cards, and I can spit out these. But he's going to have to, oh, he's going to return it again. Huh. What a guy. Do 2k. I'll take this one. Oh, I got the Moria. That's exactly what we want to see. Uh, do I honestly just KO one of these? I think so. Two cards for my trash. Yeah, double brand brand. Maybe not even brand brand because I could bring back brand brand with this. Uh, let's see. Hang on. Let's go. Let's swing six here. Yeah, no action. Let's go here. Play Absalom. Put back you and Suru. KO. Pass. This time I'm going to counter with Borsalino. I'll make sure I can counter with Borsalino so I can play Moria and bring out everything. Six. Oh. Two K. Six. I'll take. I guess I'm not bringing back the Lino. Uh, what do I want to bring back? Do I just bring back... Do I even want to hit it this turn? Do I just play two bodies? Do I just play Kuzan? Play him, poke five? Yeah, let's do that. Use a blocker if your opponent has less dawn. They're going to counter again. Interesting. Okay. Um... Yeah, let's just go ahead and play these. The next turn, I'll do this and do a whole combo. Uh, let's also turn Epsilon sideways. We can, so we can bring back Epsilon if we want. If he swings after him. Yeah. That card's really strong. Let's see. Question is now, do I want to bring him back? Bring back Brand Brand for the search is pretty money. Um, I can KO anything with Absalom. I think I just let him go. Because then I can swing Kuzan minus play Absalom. And then we're cooking. Uh, oh, Perona's a 2k. Nice. Is he going to swing 5? He's going to swing 7. Uh, I think I'm going to take the 7. Draw. Draw. Let's go. Did I minus him? No, I can minus four. I can't do any other minus because there's no Hell Meppo here. Uh, let's go minus here. Attack here, minus here. Yeah. 
And then I'm gonna... Actually, can I bring back Luchi? Oh, snap. I'm gonna clear this man's clock. Hold up. Uh, Luchi. Active. Rested. Let's brand new. I'll take it. Use action. Let's put back you. The Shigi. Uh, I'm thinking maybe her, but I'll put back. It's like I can bring back brand new. I already have one. Okay, so two and a one. And then poke five. Moria's busted. They've got, like, no gas. Do I just turn this sideways? No. How much counter do I have? 1K, 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 2K. So I've got 2, 3, 4, 5, 6K. Can I end him next turn? Maybe. Do they play triggers? And trigger. Uh, I turn him sideways. Because if he plays judge... He brings back a ton of characters. Slight problem. And he has to have two cards to do that, though. Uh, he probably can't. he probably takes it if I swing, so doesn't matter. They didn't see their field spell either. This card's pretty busted. He got that hand right back. That's crazy. Okay, seven, I will, this card can attack the turn is played, I don't know why it's shown like that, uh, I'm blocking 2k. Okay, let's see, we can KO a blocker. Um, I can play this swing seven, use to discard, bring out. Actually, I don't even have to play these. I can just swing five. Target for destruction. Now it just makes sense to block with this. Okay, maybe I should have swung larger on that, but... I think this works this way. We're gonna trash. Uh, I'll trash Kuzon. Play Absalom over here. Use card action. Yeah. And so we got two of these in there. I'll put him back. Put brand new back. And we're gonna KO this guy. Might have been able to swing with what's his name. Maybe I just go... Nine. No. Let's go seven. And maybe I just play uh Orsolino. Or maybe I just play the brand the Sabo. Okay. We got one, two, three, four. I only have four K encounter. So let's go ahead. Smack nine. He blocks. I only have two attacks now, so I'm in a good spot. We're gonna go ahead and pass no point in turning him sideways but we should be good going into the next turn and we should just be able to win i just left up a ton of dawn yeah this is a slight problem yeah judge requires two he can bring out these and now he can minus to bring out the big guys So now he's got a rusher. Now he's got a blocker. And now he's got this guy. Returns my Lino. 
That's pretty strong. Minus is two here. That feels not great. Uh, do I just take this? Then you go seven, one, two, three. Then they go at my face. I lose. Or one, two, three, four, five. I take this. They go seven, one, two, three. They go six, one, two. I have to win next turn. Uh, do I have an Absalom in the trash? Yes. Uh, I should know the card in his hand, too. Um, yeah, I'll take it. He can't attack this turn, right? Six. I will give you a 2k. Seven. Here is a 1k. Okay. What's the best way? Is it even worth it? Do I just go seven? He like has to block. And then seven connects nine. Yeah, I should just mathematically win. Let me just make sure though. Seven, nine. So it's one, two, three. It's gonna be seven for him, nine. Yeah, easy, okay. So we swing this, indicate destruction here. He should block. Yeah. And then we go seven here. Lowest dawn commitment. I don't know what trigger to get out. Okay, they draw one. We go nine, and we just all in on more. Yeah. Yeah. Perfect. All right. And as always, if you guys found this content of value, uh, if you could do me a favor, over 80% of my viewers are not subscribed. If you could subscribe to the channel, I would greatly appreciate it. It helps me out a lot. And as always, thank you so much for watching.